Hi everyone, this is Be Divine and I hope you're awesome. We're bringing the energy of Archangel Michael into this reading today. And I'm hearing that many of you really need to shield and protect yourself and that you need to forgive yourself and you need to let go of the old life and move forward into a new one. So let's let's see why this is difficult or what messages Archangel Michael has for you. Uh, you can get your own channeled message through my readings, okay? You can get your own healing and support. Um, if you need this extra healing and support, please just go to my website, all right? There's so many readings that I have um, for you. So let's keep going here. First card, positive thoughts, create positive results. Divine love and wisdom, I call upon you now. I know that my mind and emotions are eternally and continuously connected to you. I ask my higher self to be aware and conscious of the love and light that is within every person and situation. Okay. Sometimes there is a feeling like we are completely um, on our own in our pathway. And in a sense, we are on our own. It is our journey. But we always have our spiritual light team and Archangel Michael will go to anyone who calls upon him. I wrote a whole book about Archangel Michael, in fact, the angels, and it has been nothing but amazing to me how when I ask and delegate the angels to do something and I just give it to them and I just let go of myself or, or getting myself out of the way, that things really begin to change. We also need to ask for divine light to spread on the earth, you know, in places where there's been so many things that have been happening and especially in Hawaii just now. And I really hope that uh, the people there find the support, get the help that they need and that the government also really, really puts the best effort in to help all these people who are so displaced right? So we send light, we send help, we send the angels into the situation because worrying about it doesn't help us, okay? So take your time making decisions. And the last one is guarded and protected as well. Thank you for protecting my loved ones and me, ensuring we're safe and that all of our needs are met. I now accept your help, see? Uh, gratefully and gracefully, knowing that it's right for me and all others to accept this heavenly assistance. What's the point of having angels to guide you and guard you if we don't ask them to do anything? It's like they have, they're unemployed, you know, <laughs> and we've got to give them a job to do. You know, we need to direct them. It's like a lawyer. You need to direct a lawyer what, you, what you're actually asking for. You need to tell them. They don't tell you. They can advise you. But you need to actually direct, you know, your lawyer, your team, your guides in your life and say thank you for and then state what it is that you want. You know, taking your time making a decision. Some of you are going through this right now. Archangel Michael, please help me stay strong and relaxed as I approach this situation. Reminding me to detach and step back, allowing the situation to naturally unfold. Thank you for protecting me. You know, Archangel Michael, I'm telling you right now, if you call upon him at any time that you're worried about anything or any time you're frightened or before you go to bed or just any time you start talking to him as though he's your friend. Jeez, Archangel Michael, have you seen this crap over here? And he'd say, uh, yes, we're working on it. And you'll say, <laughs> you'll say, okay. Why is this so difficult for me? Why is this so challenging for me? Why am I going through this right now? And you will feel through your own energy and through your own words, you will hear the answers of the angels. What do you think the angels will say to you? Because the only person that's nasty is you towards yourself. So if you're hearing nasty messages from the divine, it's not from the divine, it's from you, okay? The divine will always give you beautiful, loving, supportive messages. They can't tell you the fortune. You, you're, they're not fortune tellers, right? But 
they can give you beautiful messages of hope, truth and light as you move forward. So what do you think they're saying to you? Keep going, stay strong, stay focused, allow your light to shine, don't give in to worry, don't give in to fears, these sorts of things, exactly coming from the divine. Things like, oh, you're just so stupid, or you can't do it because somebody else is better than you. Um, You should have done this and you should have done that. That's coming from a parental voice or it's coming from your, (laughs) your own self and how you beat yourself up, you know? So remember when you're asking for advice from the angels, they're always listening. You have to give permission for the help to arrive. You have to give permission to receive messages and you should be in a place of receiving messages, which is safe and protected. You can see any one of my declarations on YouTube, here on TikTok or anywhere. Look up Be Divine Protection. Go for it. Okay, look it up anywhere. Be Divine Protection, as long as it's my spelling. Okay, I'm here to help you to get out of your own way. That's what the angels are trying to do with you and love yourself unconditionally. So what else do we need to to know here? Okay, so we have arrival points in our life. You've been going through, um, you've been going through a time of inner challenges, okay? You've been beating yourself up and I can tell you right now, sometimes everything gets to the point where we're just like, for God's sake, where's this help? I've been asking, I've been positive. I asked the angels, nothing's happening. And then we just start falling apart, right? I am telling you in those moments when you're falling apart and you're ranting and you're raving, the rage can split open energy within you that's been held tight for a long, long time. And it allows the angels to begin to work through those cracks And I'm telling you right now, as soon as I have a meltdown, is what I call it, and I finally have a meltdown, shaking fists at the universe or whatever I'm doing, carrying on, the next day, or even during that day, like later on during the day, after I've released, everything will just change. Everything will just shift. Someone will message out of the blue. Love will come. Support will come. You know, energy will change, energy will shift and it's what I was asking for and it's suddenly I had to get to that point. It's like a a kid, they they let you get to the point where you're freaking out at them. It's like, why didn't you just listen to me when I asked you nicely? Now we've got to go through this, you know, uh, you know, (laughs) your mum's a lunatic kind of thing, you know. (laughs) Why didn't you just do what I said? Because you have to get to that point, that boiling point you know, where someone will take you seriously sometimes because you haven't been saying or expressing exactly what you want. You've been holding it in, trying to change it yourself. And when we try to protect ourselves on the inside, we get fat. (laughs) So if you can't lose your belly fat, maybe that's because it's full of crap, like literally. (laughs) So, you know, we've got to really just be funny with ourselves you know, and, and just understand ourselves as compassionately as, say, you would understand somebody else, you know, as a counsellor. You know, for me as a therapist, I'm always putting myself as though I'm the client with myself. So I can really, really kick my own butt and know what I'm doing, you know, and then let it go and you move on to the next thing. One of the other mistakes that people make is hanging on to the mistakes, you know, let it go, who cares, leave the past behind you, You, you're not going in that direction anymore, send it love, send yourself well wishes, have a vision of yourself in the past when you were really miserable and see it changing in your mind's eye, when you were giving yourself support and assistance from now into your past and you felt it and you could see it on your face, it actually changes your future. We all need to be in uh, a reality of anything we can do. No more limitations. We can do anything we set our mind to, okay? Allow the angels to help you. Archangel Michael is with you as are all of your spiritual light team and sending you lots and lots of love, okay? Many, many blessings and get your own reading. Bye for now.